John Jones faked his injury, and I'm gonna prove it in a minute. He had a fight at UFC 295, but suddenly Dana White, two days ago, posted video of him getting injured. What's up everybody, here we are again. John Jones was training last night, got injured. Lately many fighters got injured, but this one, I think it's fake. So there is a couple of reasons why I think so. John Jones had a fight against Stipe Miocic. And a lot of behind that weight, you know, a lot of punch behind that weight, a lot of weight. And Stipe is not serial gun. He has really good striking and ground game, so it will be a real challenge for John. A black man can't drink? So first, let's take a look to the footage of him getting injured. So he's wrestling some random guy he's been doing this 20 years, and he hurts his uh, shoulder or chest, right? So here's the thing, guys. Fighters are not always recording their sparring. So what are the chances that this injury happened while they're recording their sparring? First of all, there's no reason why Jones would record this sparring because his opponent, some random guy, he's doing just wrestling. As I said, he's been doing 20 years and there's nothing to see. It's just random basic sparring. Camera angle is exactly as it should be. So we can see when he's getting injured. And look, he goes for the takedown and here he already makes face that he's hurt. But in, in this position, his shoulder is normal. There is no reason why he would get injured in this position. And remember that he screams when they go on the ground fully. So here is his face again, his heart. And here comes the scream. And guess what happens next? The guy who is parring with, look what he does. He just moved away from camera. Jones is pointing to his chest and this guy just moves away so they can film it. Everybody does it, right? Your friend got hurt, move away from camera. Did you just hear a gunshot? I did. You did hear one? Yeah, I did. Where'd it come from? And this fake emotion, oh, I'm really hurt. So why would John Jones fake his injury? Let me explain. In 2016, Jones got suspended one year because of using drugs by USADA. And guess what happened to USADA recently? UFC split up with USADA because of Connor, they say. Connor money. So maybe because John Jones had really tough opponent, Stipe Miocic, he decided to take a break, like Connor did. Yeah, yeah! Yeah, look at this! Yeah. He's gonna chill, relax, take some pills, and testing is gonna be easier. So, Jones, if you need receipt for the secret juice, I have video on my channel, check it out. The secret juice! He has record 27 and 1, but we know it's 28 and 0. So, I think he's chasing Habib. And he's taking this fight seriously. Who cares? Who cares? Cyril Gunn was never a challenge for him. Especially when he saw Gunn dominated Cyril Gunn on the ground. We saw what Jones did to him. So now he's gonna go take some pills, get even bigger and bigger, stronger. And he's gonna fight Tom Aspinal or Sergei Pavlovich. Of course, he's gonna wrestle him, win his fight, and he might retire. Or maybe he has one more fight and it will be Stipe when he gets even more older and older. I'm doing great, man. How are you? I think that John Jones is GOAT of this sport, but after he had some challenging fights recently, not including Cyril Gunn, he's taking more seriously and I think he's being more careful about his legacy. We know he has ego, we know his past. <laughs> So, smart move from Jones. That's it for this video. Stay juiced. Hard set.